Hey Libra, I hope you all are doing well. This is going to be your general um, what's coming towards you reading. This is a Tyler Tarot series, so credit to Tyler Tarot. Um, I just wanted to try it out. Now this can be applied to your next three months, Libra. We're going to go ahead and jump right on in for you. What's going on for Libra? What's coming towards Libra? I do have personals open for anyone who's interested. I have a March special, but I do have other options. All the details are in the description box. Hmm, Libra. You have a void obstacle. You have attraction. And then you have success, fame, and status. Hmm. All right. Let's see what the tarot has to say about this. What's going on with the void obstacle here for Libra? The high priestess, the queen of pentacles, and the hangman. Okay. Two Pisces cards and a Capricorn card here. Be cautious of, you know, financial offers here, Libra. I feel like there could be something coming towards you where it's like there's something sketchy. Like there's not enough known about what it is that's being offered to you. It's like here's this ground floor opportunity. You know, I feel like there's something there's something to do with that here. Or maybe some kind of pyramid scheme. I would just be I would be cautious of that, okay? Um, there's something else going on here though. What else is happening here with Libra? There's something secretive in the home or surrounding family, okay? There's something that somebody's not saying. The hangman, like, it's just like, I'm going to just not involve myself in it. I'm just going to not put my hands in it. You know, high priestess, secrets, queen of pentacles, a really domestic queen, you know, representing something long term. Uh, so I do feel like this is something that's uh, going back in the family. Weird, Libra, but something's being kept. Yeah, seven of... Seven of Cups. There's some kind of secret here. What is this? There's some kind of... The Tower. The Tower. Something's starting to unravel here, okay? You're, you're going to figure out what this is. Some, or you already know what it is and people just aren't talking about it. Like the Tower hit a long time ago and it's caused a lot of trauma. It's caused a lot of chaos. Um, you know, it's stopped a lot of opportunities is mainly what I feel it is. Whether this is like a bad seed in the bunch and, you know, they've ruined a lot for everybody. Or if this is some kind of secret that was kept up until a certain point, Libra. And, you know, when you find that secret out, it kind of like rocks your world. You do have the Fool showing up here. I feel like there's something different happening to you, though, with the Fool. What's going on here with Libra? Like there's something weird happening to you here. You're feeling like something is missing. You know, there's a cut missing here. You're feeling like, I'm not like them, you know, you, and it may be because they're excluding you. There could be something going on here where you're feeling excluded. The obstacle you're avoiding could be turning out like them, could be something like that here. But, you know, it's like you're feeling like, I'm missing that gene that's making me, <laughs> is making me like them, you know. I feel like that's what you're avoiding here altogether. You could be moving away from family uh, or just toxic family members in general, Libra. But you're all of a sudden getting this like push to move away from them. You're getting this push to be cautious around these people because they've held back a lot from you or they've been greedy towards you. Something like that has gone on here. Like they kept a secret from you here. Could have been about a mother or it could have been your mother. The chariot, the hermit, the empress. You had to find something out by yourself here and that's what's, that's what's bothersome to you. Or it's possible that maybe the secret was yours and when you let it out, people wanted you to keep it. You know, they wanted you to just kind of, let's pretend that never happened. You know, um, it's an odd energy here, and it's obviously for someone very specifically, but, but that's what I'm getting. Something's going on with you here. Um, like, you're just getting a sudden push forward. Like, you've never felt anything like it, because these are the chariot, the hermit, the empress, all majors, all majors, not to mention the majors that showed up behind it. We had the fool, the high priestess. Uh, I can't even remember if others showed up. But yeah, there's there's a lot going on here. There's a lot of introspection. I feel like there's a lot of you looking at yourself, figuring out what kind of person do I want to be. Not like them. Not like her. Not like him. Uh, so it's interesting, you know. Um, I feel like you're moving away from certain energies here. And then you have attraction. Not only are you moving away from certain energies, but you're feeling called to something else here. You're feeling called to a different type of life. What's going on with this for Libra? The King of Pentacles. The Knight of Cups. Some of you are really, wow, whatever life you're moving into, whatever world you're moving into, you're going to really value honesty and truth over anything and everything, even though it's hard. It's going to bring about some big adventures for you, I can say that, but, you know, speaking truth is going to be a big 
thing for you and people speaking truth to you. Like that's going to be the deal breaker. Like you don't care how small the lie is. You know, you don't care how small the lie is. You'll cut a person out over it. Um, you have the King of Pentacles, the Knight of Cups, and the Four of Pentacles showing up here under attraction. I feel like you are attracting someone who's loyal, stable, reliable, faithful faithful and that's your that's your biggest thing here someone you can count on uh i feel like that that's what's coming towards you here but i also feel like a, a big part of this energy a big part of what's coming towards you is this energy you know to move away from certain energies that are not honest with you or that push you to try to fit in some kind of box that you just don't necessarily fit in you have the four of pentacles showing up here People are trying to grip very tightly to you as well for some reason. You have the Ace of Cups and the Page of Wands, New Adventures and Love. I feel like that's coming towards you. It, it could be a fire sign. I've got Pisces here. I've got Taurus as well. But for the most part, I feel like somebody is trying to grip onto you, but you're feeling pulled over this way. That's why this attraction card is showing up. What else have we got going on here? You have a new dream, a new goal, a new vision for yourself, for your life, Libra. Nine of Wands. People are afraid you're going to let out some kind of secret. People are afraid of how they're going to look, four of swords, but this is all about your healing and they need to just get over it. They need to just get over it. If they didn't want to be named as bad people, maybe they shouldn't have been bad people, right? There could have been a Sagittarius involved in the mix here. Like if this is a parent who was neglectful and you speak on it, so what? Like that's your experience to speak on. It's your experience to speak on, you know? If they were neglectful, then if they didn't want to be seen as neglectful, maybe they should have been neglectful, you know? It's like, this is how this affected me. It's not about me bashing you. It's about this this affected me in this way. And this is just an example. I just feel as if you guys are wanting to speak on your story, Libra, and people around you are just, it's making them uncomfortable because they could be villains in that story, you know? Or maybe they there was just a, simply a time where they were just not the best person they could be, right? And you're speaking on that. But you're also speaking on time when you were not the best person you could be, but it's stemming from those, okay? It's stemming from those experiences. You have success, fame, and status. What's going on with this for Libra? Some of you, you're, you're reaching a high point here, and that's where this is getting scary for other people. The devil is showing up here. Maybe you're signing contracts, okay? Um, maybe you're signing contracts or something of that nature, but I really feel that people are just kind of trying to drag you back in because they're facing judgment due to this change that you're making here, okay? You have eyes on you here, and they're like, scared about that Libra somebody's scared about that scared about what information you're going to feed to someone how much more you're going to share maybe uh, for financial reasons you're getting a lot of recognition knight of wands seven of swords you could have people come towards you here, Libra. Who you're, you're experiencing a lot of success. This is definitely for someone super, super specific, but experiencing a lot of success. You could have three people come towards you, maybe up to seven come towards you, trying to take something from you here. Just be cautious with that. It's like you're speaking on my character, blah, 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 you know. Um, something like that could be going on here. Or they could be doing it in an even more shady way and trying to reunite with you, trying to um, rectify things in order to gain something from you here. Because I feel like you're shocking a lot of people Libra I really do I feel like you're really yeah they're wanting you to share some kind of wealth you've got that share the wealth card right underneath that power right underneath that they're trying to regain that upper hand be careful with this energy feels familial to me like I said but it could be an ex okay it could be but yeah that is what I'm seeing here for you Libra something weird going on with you but it, it ends in a positive way just as long as you can keep other people's hands out of it and as long as you can um how do I describe that <laughs> how do I word that there as long as you can keep them from influencing what it is that you're doing and how you tell your story, as long as you can keep them from silencing you, is basically the overall vibe that I'm getting here. I do have personal readings open, Libra, for anyone who may be interested. Details are down in the description box, okay? But if this is where we part, thank you all for watching this part. I really appreciate you, and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye.